So this video is for a gentleman called Wahid, um, who sent me an email. He's looking to get into recruitment. Um, he doesn't know how, or he's got some interviews lined up and just wants some tips. So I thought I'd make a video because he made some good points in the email. Um, I won't read it out, but he asked, you know, my response um, to the sector, how it's doing. Um, how I'm going to talk about how much recruitment consultants roughly get paid. Um, it depends on the industry. Um, and also how to actually get a job as a recruitment consultant um, and how much we get paid. So first things first, recruitment is at its peak at the moment. In that sense that when, as a business owner, I've been a business owner that's tried to hire and I've been hired myself. So I see certain niches and skills are very hard to find. Um, for example, I don't know off the top of my head, Oh, I don't know. Someone that's works in the energy sector or a very specialist doctor. Let's, let's use a doctor. A very specialist doctor. Let's say um, he operates on the leg only. How would you as an employer go about finding someone like that? Because most of the time, doctors are really, really... Um, unemployed doctors are very hard to find. They're usually retired or they, you know... Um, don't actually want to work or they just do their own thing so because there's no unemployment in doctors you need to go to a recruitment consultant and say to them can you find me a doctor um you know i'll pay you as a business owner so a recruitment consultant will spend all their day setting up meetings with doctors now they will do this number of ways most recruitment consultants will go on LinkedIn, find a load of doctors, message them, and try and entice them into, you know, joining their agency. Usually, it's a doctor that might be on a gap year or a break. Usually, they the really, really smart, good ones will be in a relationship with graduates that are nearly qualified, and you line their job up, and you snap them up like that. A lot of people do it with teachers, but most people don't do it with doctors. Now, LinkedIn is a powerful resource. This is what recruitment consultants will be doing in that sense. Um, that's the main part of the job. You won't be just sitting on LinkedIn messaging loads of people. That's just a small, small part of the job. Some firms, you will be cold calling. Some firms, um, I mean, I've made loads of videos on cold calling, how to do it. Some videos, not videos, some firms will actually get you to cold call a lot. They call it business development. Now, this could be something great because you can win a massive contract if you get one or two employers. If you get a hospital, for example, that take on nurses, doctors for you, yeah, in the droves, all the time, every month, every year. Now, there's two types of, uh, I should really talk about the agency and the actual permanent and temporary. A lot of firms structure on a daily rate. So a doctor might get, let's say, 300 pound, um every day um on your agency you will take a 25 pound cut um your company will take 20 and you'll take five a day let's say for example five a day um that's your little bonus that goes on that's the agency or you know temporary so you get paid kind of daily and um, there's the agency one where you get a fat massive check now you can get 5k 10k um if you get a really specialist doctor or really like uh, big ceo type of job um, you get a 10-20% of their annual salary depending on how, how your firm structures its pay but you can get a big big fat check it's not not uncommon for people to make a million pound from recruitment a year not every year but some years like I said in the start of the video unemployment is low recruitment is booming because Employers can't find these people. They don't know how. I see them. They're like, do you know anyone? My boss used to came to me and said, do you know anyone that can do this? And it's like, he doesn't even know how to put an advert out online. Where a recruitment consultant would put ads everywhere. If you search um, doctor's jobs, there'll be a recruitment club up there. Paying big money to be here. Because it's a fact check at the end. So they want to attract, you want to attract docs. But the main thing how to actually get a job if i was hiring a recruitment so i can go to most recruitment firms 
and get a job I can ring them and say yeah so how probably best to get a job is not applying on a CV because recruitment consultants we see CVs all the time we judge big time on CVs we find we got such a negative outlook because we don't want when the worst thing is when people waste our time we put someone for an interview and they just turn out to be a liar or they're shit and they don't turn up a recruitment consultant will not waste time on a bad CV. If I see one spelling error, I'll get rid of it. Because if the employer says that, sees that and they say to me, why the hell did you send me someone with a C that can't even spell? It makes me look bad. It makes me look like I'm just a cowboy. So your CV needs to be on point or don't send your CV in. Go in, find an advert, ring up there. I should really make a video on this, me doing this. Because it will get you an interview on the phone. Uh, go see an advert, ring up the firm and say, look, I want to work for you. Most recruitment firms will take someone on. They will create a desk for you if you can generate business. Yeah, I can walk into most firms and I can say, look, these are my stats. I'll print off my data, bring it to them and say, look, this is me. Can you give me a job? They'll say, wow, this guy can generate business. He can also place people. Let me give him a job. He, I, I created my own job now in a totally different sector and my company I was like look I want to do this, this 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 it's fine that's fine come on board here's your desk here's your computer here's your laptop here's your phone and um, get on with it here's your commissions so going from there bring up a firm and tell them I'm looking to work for you guys tell them why and ask them who to speak to you may see an advert online you will be 10 times more likely to get a job because we do everything on the phone we call up we see people that email as cowboys and uh, scaredy cats if you ring up and talk to talk on the phone look, hi my name's Kayla um you know I'm looking to work for you guys I'm interested in this I've sold this I do this you know let me come in for a day can I meet you can I drop them? if they say yeah send your CV over say no I I'm gonna come down and drop my CV off they love that. They get excited, man. They love it. You know, do, do things like this. It's, it's, it's just this little, you know, thing. But going ahead with this, recruitment is big, big. It's a good, good bloody industry, man. It's a tough industry. Not everyone can do it. I see probably 90% of recruitment consultants are bad. They're sleazy. They'll do anything for a commission. And they don't want to do a good job. Whereas I'm in, I'm not in top ten percent, but I'm I'm a good recruiter. Um, I get a lot of my business from, you know, clients, and they just ring me and say, "Look, such a good service." They always tell my boss, man, it's really good. They always just say, "Look, I had such a bad service, and now I come to this guy, and he's just giving me such a good service." Um, we want another person, and that's it. The good firms will have that already set up for you. Your job is to find good candidates that will secure the job, do the job. All year round. If you want to get paid, you go in early. The hours can be long. You could work 50, 60 hours a week. But you should make 60 grand in your first year if you go all in. Do not look at an advert and say they're only advertising 40k, 30k, 20k. 16k you should make 60 grand no problem second and third year you should make 100 grand if you don't you need to sell something else if you can sell in, in recruitment you got that friendly personality that can get in there you make someone laugh they'll work with you remember that and that goes with a job as well Wade, good luck with everything, mate. Let me know. <laughs> I'll shoot you an email as well, mate. Cheers, bye.